36 hours on, the student protest at Banaras Hindu University has only turned more violent. Students have been demanding justice and better security at the campus after a student was allegedly molested. But while the police resorted to lati charge, the vice chancellor decided to look the other way. Now, Congress Vice President Rahul Gandhi has taken on the Yogi government, saying, "Is this the Beti Bachao Beti Parhao Andolan proposed by the Modi government?" Amir Haq, our Lucknow bureau chief, joining us live. Amir, the situation was clearly allowed to escalate because what we are given to understand by the sequence of events is that the students were following due diligence, due procedure by approaching the proctor. Their grievances were not paid any heed to, and later there was a lati charge. And look at what has happened now. There are severe clashes. What is the ground situation at the moment? Well, you are absolutely right, Afrida, because uh, all of this actually started on Thursday evening, just a day before the Prime Minister was to visit Varanasi on a two-day visit, mm -hmm. and uh, the local administration and the BHU authorities, perhaps, uh, uh, you know, uh, they, they were so conscious of uh, PM's presence in Varanasi that they decided to sweep the entire controversy under the carpet mm -hmm. and uh, try to uh, keep uh, all such protesting students absolutely silent, and that was what. Uh, really uh, you know blew up just uh, just uh, within hours after the prime minister actually left varanasi after completing his visit yes. this girl who was actually molested there inside the bhu campus was uh, sitting after shaving off her hair uh, shaving off her head uh, on hmm. protest and that protest continued till uh, two days and it was on late saturday night that the police tried to use force to dispel uh, to kind of uh, quell these protests and that was what agitated these students because they were demanding security on the campus for girls and there was nothing wrong with that.